It went all the way from Memphis to, okay. It was 4th of July, 1972. And he was how old was you, about four? About four years old. Four years old, my daughter was 11. We were at the back gate, which was very unusual. All the fans were at the front gate. So we were at the back gate, so all of a sudden, they send uh, this Lincoln Continental out the front gate to fool the fans, I guess. But he come on the motorcycle at the back gate. So we followed him. <laughs> Down the one-way street. We went all the way to Little Rock, Arkansas from Memphis, Tennessee, <coughs> and he pulled over and talked to us at the airport. And um, as we was going down the road, they had tapes, um, the A-track tapes, holding them up to the windows as we passed him. And we knew who he was because he was on a bike right beside us on the interstate. But he was so, so, so nice. We had pictures made and everything, and then come find out. I had two cameras, and one camera had tore the film in two, so I just took it and threw it in the car. I didn't know what was wrong with it, and then picked up the other camera. We didn't have a flash, and back then it was just stormy and dark that day, and ended up with none of the pictures took but one. But it wasn't us. He was on the bike. He picture at the house. He did email you the picture to let you see that course. He was signing everything. Autograph. Yeah, I got autographs. I was scared of him. I was four years old. I'd seen him on TV and everything, and I didn't know how to act. So I was really in a Volkswagen station wagon. He'd come around the back, he tapped on the glass, and he looked at me and said, Come on out here, little buddy, and get your picture with me. And then I got out, got to meet him. And I got out crying. I've loved Mom. you for 16 years. <laughs> so he kissed me three times. <laughs>